course, we have to play better cricket. Uh, we, which I said uh, after the last game that we didn't do. We didn't play good cricket. We were uh, we were short in lot of departments. Uh, we were not uh, good on the field. Um, so yeah, those are the things we need to uh, recalculate and bring it uh, into this game. Um, so yeah, we we will try and do that. Uh, it, it is it is important to focus uh, on the mistakes that we made and make sure those mistakes are not repeated again uh, because that is a sign of a good good team uh, when you don't repeat mistakes. Uh, so yes, it gives us a great opportunity to do that, reflect on what mistakes we made, and then try not to make uh, those mistakes in the in the coming games. Uh, see, uh, by the looks of it, the pitch looks good. Uh, Rajkot has always been a good track to bat, uh, and it does offer some assistance uh, to the uh, to the bowlers also. So, yes, it will be a good pitch. Uh, uh, I think I'm pretty sure it will be better than Delhi. What uh, what we saw in Delhi. Yeah, look, uh, I, I, I don't think we need to we need to think about what happened there. Uh, of course, I think the combination that we played in the last game, uh, it was based on the pitch that was on offer in Delhi. So we will see the pitch again today and uh, we will think uh, as of uh, what we need to do in our uh, bowling lineup. I think our batting looks good. Uh, so I don't think there's any change that we need to bring in our batting. Uh, but uh, we'll see. We'll analyze the pitch. We'll see, uh, you know, uh, if there's any change in the pitch. What from what we saw yesterday to today. So uh, based on that, we'll we'll try and see what we can do as a team. No pressure is just on the team, uh, you know, to perform. As, as simple as that. Uh, no particular department, I would say. Uh, you know, because uh, you have lost as a team, you have not lost as a bowler, uh, as a bowling unit. You have lost as a team, so the focus will be on the team to perform. Uh, so, collectively, all all of us need to come together. Uh, the batters need to get the job done, and the bowlers need to come out and get those crucial wickets and defend the score. Or, uh, if we are batting for, uh, if we are bowling first, restrict them to a good score, which we can chase it later on. So that will be the idea. Uh, we are not focusing on any individual department. We need to focus uh, on everyone as a team uh, because we lost as a team, not as individuals. I just mic here. We were, yeah, of course. See, we saw the conditions were not were, were not ideal. Uh, uh, there was something on the offer. The pitch was a little soft, as I mentioned. Uh, so the shot making, because we all love to play shots, uh, the shot making was not that easy. Uh, so we have to assess and see uh, uh, what sort of score we want in the first six, and then seven to fifteen, and then in the last five overs. We, you have to break it down like that. Uh, so. When you are playing on a pitch like that, you need to understand what, what will be the ideal score for you to defend. Uh, so, of course, that was the idea and that's what the batsmen were trying to do. But if the pitch is good, you will see a different uh, Team India approach tomorrow. On T20 format. Nothing. I mean, see, of course, you you need to understand T. This this is the format where we are trying a lot of players. Uh, the key players.
the key players please uh, keep your phone on silent boss uh, the key players are not involved uh, so we are trying a lot of younger players who are there in the lot sitting on the fringe um, uh, so probably that is one of the reason to be honest uh, because we you know uh, the other formats uh, we we have our entire squad playing the game uh, so you get you get what you want from that particular squad but this is the format where you can try and there is no harm in doing that uh, we want to try a lot of players to make them ready uh, to get them ready for the other formats also because this is the format where you know these individuals can come out and express themselves uh, so that they are ready for odi cricket and test cricket also you know we have seen a lot of players who have emerged from these formats and gone on to play uh, odi format and test format also so you know we want we want our bench strength to be as strong as possible so this is probably the reason you know why you see so many new guys coming into the fray and you know playing this format but having said that it doesn't mean that uh, you know uh, we we have to uh, not win games we have to win games that's the first priority but again these guys will learn from it you know uh, that's how uh, all of us including myself and the other guys uh, who started playing this format first and then went on to play odi and then uh, test cricket so i think that's how it happens and uh, we as i said we just want our bench strength to be very very strong so this is the format to try all these guys and you know emerge uh, from this particular format स्ट्रैटेजी तो मैं बता नहीं सकता बट मैं ये बता सकता हूँ कि हमारे अप्रोच में थोड़ा चेंजेस होगा आ, क्योंकि जो लास्ट मैच में हमने किया वो पिच के मुताबिक हम खेल रहे थे आ, पिच जिस तरीके से रिएक्ट कर रही थी उस तरीके से हम खेल रहे थे बट अगर यहाँ पर पिच अच्छा है तो हमारा अप्रोच थोड़ा डिफरेंट होगा बोलिंग में भी और बैटिंग में भी क्योंकि हमने देखा कि डेली का पिच थोड़ा चैलेंजिंग था आ, और ग्रिप हो रहा था बॉल टर्न हो रहा था तो वैसे पिच पे आपको पता नहीं रहता है कि सही स्कोर क्या है तो ये पिच की बात करें ये पिच शायद दिल्ली के पिच से अच्छा खेलेगा तो यहाँ पे हमारा अप्रोच स्लाइटली डिफरेंट होगा see it's very simple uh, i'm playing for india and uh, i'm playing for my country it's it's the biggest motivation ever to play for your country uh, it doesn't matter whichever which format you are playing uh, at the end of the day it's just about going there going out there and doing your best uh, formats will keep changing uh, i'm playing t20 format now in few weeks time i'll be playing test format so the format is not so much important uh, what is important that i am representing my country and i have to go out there and do my best that is what keeps me going knowing that i am one of 1 1.5 billion 1.3 billion people who has an opportunity to go out and represent the country so that is what keeps me going and that is what uh, will keep me going for the rest of my career as well